Hey guys, how's this going? It's Joey at Scrub City Media, and today I am going to be starting something kind of new. We're going to be doing a little series, and we're going to play Night in the Woods. It's a game I've been very interested in, and it was on sale, so I had to cop it and buy it to play it. I know, it's 2023, and I am just now playing Night in the Woods. I have only seen the tiny, littlest bit of gameplay on it, but anyways, let's go ahead and get started, because you guys didn't come here to see me talk, and I have no clue how to actually start the game. Legit, alright, there we go. Figured it out, it was space. Got it. In the year Grandad died. The highway extension came. The road through Possum Springs had only had been the only way to the state park. The highway took the traffic, but gave us Donut Wolf. Grandad left me an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories, and quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. Alright, so we can change the words. In their, in their wings, in their trees, all things die, be at peace. On his last day, he sat up suddenly and stared bug-eyed through the window. I feel like this is more like at the old parking lots. Wide and sparkling like oceans, he turned to my dad, eyes still wide. This house is haunted, he said, and he died. All right, well, that's a pretty dark start. Well, this is great. I mean, I didn't expect a party or anything, but I figured someone would be here. Welcome home, eh? All right, I have no clue how you interact with anything. Wow, when did they put this up? Possum Springs never looked more falsely advertised. It must be such a relief to pay phone to pay phone companies that Possum Springs gets zero call reception. It'd be cool to call my parents, but some jerko took time to actually rip it off. Who steals a payphone? Vasco Fox, you are too dreamy. Yeah, I mean he's he's pretty stunning. All right. Welcome back to Garbo, Mallory. What's in the news today, Mallory? Maui? Markets were up today. Way up. I'm looking at a chart. It's pretty impressive. The economy added 15,000 jobs. Interesting. Excuse me, but where is everybody? It's 1045. It's closed. Not a lot of folks getting off the last buffs to Pops of Springs these days. Just you. So are you the janitor or something? Looks that way. What do you do? I fix this door. That's it. Nope. Can I squeeze past you? Nope, just broke the damn thing. When do you think it might be done? Right after you go grab me a fris a Frisca Cola from the vending machine. Am I paying for this? I always rig it when I'm here after hours. Nice, free as in free. Free as in no one say or to say otherwise. Alright, cool. I like the art style of this game. What the? They have lime Frisco and he wants a VS Cola. Just a waste. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Okay, just gotta grab it. Alright. There we go. I don't know why that was so hard. It's probably because the buttons are mapped a little weird. Guessing you're supposed to probably play this with controller. One Frisca Cola. Hmm. 
memories. So what are you doing here? I live here. We all lived here. Huh, strange. When do you think that the door is going to be finished? Now. Goodbye. Uh, bye. Cool. Well, I just turn off the lights on you. It's already this dark. That's about how dark it looks right now at my how uh, like my place actually outside. Well, I'm right outside town. Mom and dad nowhere to be found. Dark and cold. Guess I'm walking alone. What a cool just image, dude. Like, so I know a little bit of the history on this, because, like, I remember this game and Hyper Light Drifter came out at the same time, and I more so played Hyper Light Drifter, but I remember the two devs are talked about pretty heavy within the, like, indie style community. This bus station is maybe the newest thing in Possum Springs. I guess they got state founding or something. It makes a good first or last impression, I suppose. If not for the abandoned glass factory back there. Not getting rid of that anytime soon. But I'm pretty sure that the developer that made this game suffered from depression and this was kind of like his story about it. I didn't realize how much I missed the sound of that train. I used to hear it in my bed at night during the winter when the leaves when the leaves were down. And uh I remember there being an article that was released that said that he ended up killing himself, I'm pretty sure, so that really sucks. Well, I guess I'm going to hike through the woods. Through the woods is home, my bed, and my neglected parent, and my negligent parents. Shoot, I can't read. But that also made me kind of want to check out the game more, because if that's supposed to be like his lineage, his, what he got left behind after all of this... Oh, this is some dank nature. Dank nature and garbage. Then I really would definitely want to see it through, and I've always been curious about the game because I've heard it's been very... Well, like, like a cult classic. I don't know how else to describe it. There used to be an old sawmill around here, I think. I mean, the park up there is called Sawmill Park. Looks like they lost a log, a log load at some point. Sigh. So Gonna have to climb this, I guess. Alright. Pretty easy. Peasy. Alright. Maybe not so e easy peasy. Okay. Oh my god. That was dangerous. I could have died. That was amazing. I'm not going to die in this hole. Alright. There we go. I like the detail on the trees there. That's really cool. Wow. I haven't been here in maybe 10 years. And apparently no one else has. Hello, dude. This is cool. Ahoy! Dude, like, as if this is, like, your old, like, playground. Like, I could picture this if I went back to, like, my hometown, where, like, I grew up. I could, like, picture doing something like this. It looks like the slider is gone. If I could just get to the top of this thing... Ugh. Oh. I could never make it up onto that tree when I was a kid. The number of logs mocked me. The logs and the other kids. Let me see if I can visualize this. Hmm. Can't stop running while I do this, not even for a second. Gotta have enough momentum. I think I can do it. Run, jump, jump, jump. Yeah, easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. It's only been two years since I lived here. Not in this playground. Possum Springs, I mean. This is all getting jumbled. I should down. I should write it down. Oop, granddad, your parents forgot you. Oop, that's not what I wanted to do. All right. Well, got really good balance apparently. Oh, 
Hello, May. Been a while. Hey, what are you doing out here? Nothing better to do. I was out here doing my rounds, and I saw you in the very off-limits playground. So, get in the car, May. No. Do you want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. Hey, remember me? Uh, May, you gave me a heart attack. Good. What are you doing? Oh, May, honey, we thought you were coming tomorrow night. Oh, you thought wrong. How did you get here? I walked until I got arrested by Aunt Mall Cop. Oh, did you say hi to Molly for me? No. I say hi for no one. F the cops. I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Or are we waiting for tomorrow night for that too? Ah, May, so good to hear that voice again. Good night. Alright, well, I guess we... I don't know what room is our room. I keep hit it, hitting E when it's F for those two, by the way. There are a few things hanging around in here. There are a few things hanging around in here from the old country. This clock, the truck, and the storage room. And whatever is buried under the house after the cement incident. Alright, interesting. I'm gonna guess this is a room. Uh... Since when is this crawl space all jammed up? Wonder if mom and dad can move with them. Alright, well. Cool. Guess I'm not going in there. Alright, interesting. Can't do anything here. Nope. Alright, up we go. Alright, I'm guessing this is her room then.